weekend in the last video we, wa we watched how to create a development certificate using the Apple developer portal in the iOS app development now in this tutorial or in this video we will cover how to create a provisioning profiles a development provisioning profiles uh, using the developer portal uh, in the iOS app development so let's start here you can see our previously created uh, a developer certificate and now for the provision of files we will tap here and when we tap here so you can see this is the development profile for iOS and this is for tvOS so if you create this let's continue now it's asked for the app ID so if you have not created the app ID this is your first time go to app IDs and tap here the plus icon name it, it my first app and name it the bundle identifier as com dot dot my first app so this is the bundle identifier it's it's uh, it's required because everything is linked to your app using this identifier so I was in iOS app development each app is recognized by this bundle ID and here you can select the services if your app uh, gives services of app groups Apple pay associated demand data protection game center is by default checked in app purchase by default home kit health kit in network external personal VPN push notifications Siri kit work you can select it if your app provide those services if not then leave it as it as and press continue and here it's showing the asking for the confirmation that this is your first app this is identified and press register so here if this is registered and here you can see my first app the, the app id is registered now we can go to the development provision profile we will create iOS app development provision file here we will select iOS app development and then press continue now from the app ids we will select my first app Let's continue and now we will select the certificate since we created both the certificates and are valid so we can select both certificates and now we press continue here you can see the devices so if you didn't add the devices then you can add the devices from here this is all devices here you can see the listing of the device I gave it the names and this is the UTID of that particular person's iPhone so you can create here you can register name and then type the name like my iPhone here you have to type the UDID whatever it is so you have to type it is so I am not going to do this because I already added my iPhone so so, so you can only register 100 devices if you have the developer portal of $99 per year subscription so here we will go back to our development provision profile and we will create it we will select iOS app development press continue select the app id this is my app id and then we will select the certificates which you know we which want to link our provision file so that you can sign the app and we will select all the devices here press continue and we will name it my first uh, dev so it's dev means that this provision profile is related to development and we can press continue so here it's ready ready to download you can save it and you can now find it sorry for that and this is the my first app you can double click install you can see if you have export installed you can see here it gets installed here so you can if you want like this I will open it and in the build setting you can you can see here we can we will specify it here and this is my app and here because in the border you, you can you can see this is the first app development is listed here so you can check that that is meet that criteria
of the bundle ID like this it, the different bundle ID so we can't assign that app so here in this video you learn how to create a development provision file using development portal in iOS app 12 minute. hope you enjoyed the video if you like then please like and share the video and subscribe to our channel thanks and thanks for watching bye bye for now